There's an estimated 100 million children involved in child labour in India. In 2006, a new law banned children under 14 from working in shops and restaurants. But it's not always enforced. Children living in the Delhi slums are working together with local charities to campaign on children's rights. They know child labour's often an economic necessity, but want all children to go to school. And they want to change attitudes locally. At this meeting, one of the group's members, Savita, is discussing the new child labour law with the younger children. I want to talk to you all about the new law on child labour. How many of you know about this law? The young campaigners come from some of the poorest areas of Delhi, where many children have to work. So, do you think this new law banning children from working is actually going to put an end to child labour? Who of you here have seen children working? Over a thousand young people are involved in this campaign. They have regular meetings and demonstrations and stage street plays about the issues that affect their lives. After the meeting, members of the group go back to their own neighbourhoods to talk about child labour. By knocking on people's doors and talking to parents, they hope to change attitudes. Have you seen children working around here? Yes, I've seen loads of kids working in restaurants and shops. People make kids work. They don't let them study. I've seen it a lot. I've seen parents who spend their money on alcohol, and they shouldn't. They should make sure their kids go to school, not make them work. I've seen them doing shoe polishing and all kinds of things. Most of them are only little, but they're definitely not going to school. We want to let people know more about the situation for these kids we're talking about. So we're doing a play later on. Children put on plays about child labour that everyone can watch for free. They want the plays to educate people and make parents think about their own behaviour and the rights of their children. What did you think of the play? Oh, it was really funny. So, should kids work? No. What comes first? Education? Yeah, education. If you see children working under 14, you can call this FIFA number to report the employees to the police. Ultimately, the young people here would like to see an end to child labour. But there are no state benefits in India, and millions of children and their families need this income to survive. We were told that what's really important now is to make sure children who do have to work are protected and their basic human rights upheld. I think what the government should do, as well as banning child labour, is bring in new schemes like vocational training so that children who are working can learn new skills. And for the children who do still have to work, there should be school available in the evenings so they can study. At the moment, schools are empty in the evenings. They should start night school so that all children have the chance to get an education. There are so many children here who work. We're doing this because we want to make sure all children get everything they're entitled to. If children get their rights, they'll get all their needs. All their needs. Their food, their drink, living, studying, playing, everything. That's what we want.